Hey boo, good morning. It is it is a Tuesday morning and I'm just so happy to be sitting down here chatting with y'all. So this video is going to be quick, minimal amount of editing because I have to go. I am headed back to work and I'm excited to be back with my coworkers. So <sighs> the, this video is just to check in, let y'all know how I'm doing. I did update on my community post. I'm doing great. I got power back. Today is Tuesday. I got it back Sunday night. So I was without power Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And it was a bit rough, but I ain't gonna hold y'all. It ain't like I ain't never had, not had power before. <laughs> so that's just the beauty of life. I wanted to let y'all know that we are okay. We are very alive and we are very healthy. I did get some minimal damage to my home. Not as much as the last hurricane the week before. And that's my little, um, she's under the cover, so she's laying down. So if you see some movement back there, that's her. Um, I didn't get as much damage as I did for the first hurricane. There was a few pieces that fell off of my roof. Um, so I do have to get my roof assessed. And other than that, the shed wasn't there to collapse. I had a lot of tree damage lot a lot of tree damage so I had two live oaks in my yard the first was huge and I ended up asking the county for a permit to actually cut both of them one of them was dying so the county gave me a permit to do it and then the second it's not in the stage of death that the first one is so they did not let me cut it which is good because I ran out of money y'all for that project that project cost us close to 7k just cutting down the tree and the haul away and the cleanup wasn't even included so we had to cut corners there my husband and i had to do that y'all it was a monster of a tree i'll try to insert some pictures in the video uh, so then I have this other live oak. Um, we ended up getting some branches pruned, which would help it actually with stain. And it did with stain. In my county, so many oak trees literally uprooted and like either fell on houses, fell on cars. My neighbor's oak tree branch fell on his brand new Porsche, honey. Um, and it's, it, they, they're, they just, I don't know what it was about this event that the oak trees just did not survive it. So my oak tree, like tons of branches of it came off enough. That was like a full tree. And we end up spending a substantial amount of time and energy getting that cleaned up. And it is on the curb and prayerfully the city will come and get it. I do plan on getting it pruned some more because some of the branches are still inside of the tree and they're broken. And the next time we get a gust of wind, child, them things gonna come tumbling down. So yeah, um, other than that, we were good. We were without power. Um, I lost all of my food, like every single piece of my food in my refrigerator. I went ahead and I cleaned that thing out, girl. And all of the food that was in my deep freezer, which I was saving for a rainy day, but whatever. I'm just happy that we're here. Um, I did reach, a lot of people are like going to be saying reach out to FEMA. I did reach out to FEMA. My first claim from FEMA from Hurricane Helene, they denied it. This claim, it says pending. So I'm not sure what is going to happen with that. One thing about me is I'm going to start out a video talking about my fragrance of the day. So I am wearing Chance by Chanel. This is a floral, perfumey, light, clean girl type of scent. I love it so much. It is a classic and I fragrance layered it with the similar smelling body butter, which is by Brightest Bloom. Sh Chanel's Chance does have a little bit more of a lighter floral in there, but nonetheless, these two are amazing for fragrance layering. All right, so let's get back to it. So yeah, so that is it as far as the extent of the damage. I am about to go on a trip, which I do plan on vlogging, but I do want to get some videos out um, before so that I can enjoy my trip without thinking about like if I am giving y'all what y'all need. So in the comments, let me know what are some things you would like to see from me. 
I am going to be going on a low buy up until January 1st. So that means I'm not going to be buying very much. So you won't see a lot of hauls, but y'all don't usually get a lot of hauls from me anyway. Um, so you won't see a lot of hauls. So I'm really going to be focusing in on what I got. I'm going to be reviewing some stuff. I think I want to start a series where I review a fragrance and wear it before I unhaul it. So I think I'm gonna put like a certain amount of fragrances on the chopping block and I'm going to review them and wear them. And after I wear them in the review, I'm gonna let y'all know if I'm going to unhaul it. So let me know what y'all think about that. Um, it's probably gonna be um, this fragrance has one wear until it self-destructs or something like that. Um, so I'll probably do something like that, but let me know what y'all like to think. I know y'all love hauls and stuff like that, but I, my collection is just growing too much. And at this point, I ain't gonna hold you. I do plan on getting rid of substantial amount of my collection. So you'll see a lot of quick reviews, like five or 10 minute reviews on certain fragrances. And then I'm gonna unhaul it. I'm not sure if I'm gonna put it on Mercari because to be honest, I don't feel like dealing with my car. I don't feel like shipping. I don't feel like doing all of that. Um, so I'm thinking I might just donate them. Um, but right now, a lot of people are unhauling. So I don't know if people are going to want some perfumes or not. But nonetheless, I'll go ahead and find something to do with them. Let me know in the comments how you're doing. What are you wearing today? What are some video recommendations that you're going to want from me? And yeah, of course, I'm going to be keeping up with the sales. Of course, I'm going to be giving you some product recommendations and my layering combos. I'm just wondering what other things you'd like to see from me. So if you've gotten this far in a video, give me a flower to let me know that you are rocking with Chanel Chance and Brightest Bloom. Until the next video, love you. Okay, bye.